Hello and welcome. My name is Prue or Prue Luru, and today I'm going to unbox my level three beauty loop box. This just came out today. It's the first of October, 4:30 p.m. right now. I'm probably going to chill out a little bit before I edit and upload this, but well, um, I'm sorry I've been a little bit behind in my videos. I've just been pretty busy, but I'm excited to get some stuff filmed and edited and up for you guys. I've got some stuff lined up, but today this is for. Us Australians and nosy people from the other, <laughs> from other countries who want to see what kind of gifts or reward systems other systems have. So Mecca have three levels: one, two, three. Uh, level three is the highest, and it just means I spent way too much money at Mecca this year. But it also means I get the most deluxe of the sample. I've gone away with the fold-out card if you've used it, and now they just send it to a website which is here and it's www.mecha.com.au slash level three. So I think you could just go to like slash level two level and slash level one if you want to see what everyone's getting. And usually there's a selection of like six samples and we get like a selection of four per box. You don't know what they are and you don't get to choose, but here's what I got. I do, I've got to say I miss the card. Um, and they've still got the paper. Like when they're trying to be waste reduction I would like to see instead of the paper those dissolving biodegradable like things and then I would still like to have the card because the card was just quite handy instead of going to a website even though I know I know I can do it so the samples I got if you just want to see a quick rundown is glow recipe gentle cleanser blueberry bounce verso hydrating serum Too Faced damn girl mascara sample and a NARS lip in Toledo. It's a satin. So apparently we asked for this paper. I've never seen anyone complain about the paper. So I got a NARS lipstick. It's the next generation with formulas in satin, matte and sheer shine. So uh, I think I saw Chloe Morello post about these and when she went to the NARS event. So 72 shades, lip conditions. No parabens. That's exciting. So we might as well just try it on because my lips have worn off anyway. So I do really love the NARS minis that they give. I did get the Christmas set of these and it was like 30 bucks for two of them last year. So I'm kind of excited. Nice neutral color. Goes on smooth, creamy. I mean, it's like not too creamy. It's a little bit dry, but it's not bad. I'm not too mad at it. The Glow Recipe Blueberry Cleanser. This goes for $52 for the full size and cleanse, clarify, and remove makeup. Pore refining cleanser. Oh, it's got hyaluronic acid and it hates chase. Hmm. All right. I kind of have been looking for a new makeup remover, so I'm excited to give this a try. Let's uncap. Mm, it smells very strong, like, like blueberries, and it's just like a clear gel. I don't know if you can see that bit. I just squirted it up. So, uh, the Glow Recipe stuff has, like, had my attention in store, so I think this is a really smart thing to have included. I've got the, what is this? Ah, oh, this isn't even on the damn list. Oh, here it is. Oh, this should, this goes for $145 in the full size. That's 30 mils. Oh my god. Really? Verso Hydration Serum. Yeah, all right. This is worth 50 bucks. Highly nourishing serum has been formulated with the inclusion of, I can never say that word, ni ni niacinamide, providing immediate moisturizing, long-term hydration. All right. You've got my attention. Damn. The 30 mils of this goes for $145 and this is 10 mils. Wow. Okay. I'm impressed. I've got the Too Faced Damn Girl Mascara. I mean, like, curious to try it. <laughs> oh, how cute is this packaging? Well, it's, I've got like my old mascara on, but we can, we can so go over that. So the six mils and oh, why does everyone do this style of wand? See, I just, I don't really like this style of wand, but I'll, I'll I keep using it and I keep buying them, but it's the hourglass style of wand. Um, it smells like the other one. Do I have the Too Faced? Yeah, Too Faced better than sex. 
It smells like that. I mean, what's the difference between this and better than sex? Alright, my, my lashes are too dry to do it. But you can see I got like some, some stuff going on. But let's have a look. I do have a better than sex. I've got the full size. Alright, so this is better than sex right here. And this is my, like the damn girl. Sorry, I should find something better than my face to put behind you. Let's see if this works. Kind of. Um. So damn girl seems like it's bigger. And I already thought better than sex was too big for me. Eh. I don't know. I'll try it because, I mean, why not? And like, I just, I have a bit of a mascara problem. But it's shiny. I like the packaging. Cool. Let's have a look. So I actually saw, so when I first logged onto the page, they had like the main five things I could have gotten and then it expands to what I could have got. So let's just take a look at what it says I could have gotten. Um, so there's the Glow Recipe Avocado Melt Sleeping Mask. That does smell really nice and I've smelled it a few times and it would be interesting. Hourglass Caution Extreme Lash. I'm glad I didn't get that because I've had the mini of that before and I hate it. Revitalizing Scalp Mask. Ooh. I'm kind of like super into scalp masks lately. Anyone else? Really just me. That would have been cool. Deep Cleansing Mask. I don't know. I just, I don't really get masks. The Good Jeans Lactic Acid Cream. That could have been cool to try, but I'm not too stressed. And yeah. All right, that's pretty good. All right, so yeah, cool. So I can go check and see what everyone else would have gotten. So they got a Stiller Lip. Oh, those are pretty good. Lancome Advanced Genifique. That's a pretty good one. I don't mind it. The Veil Primer. I have it. I don't know if I love it. The Bare Minerals Mascara. Oh, I think my friend's going to be pretty happy about that, but I'm not so bad. And Drunk Elephant Lala Retro Whipped Cream. All right, I'm jealous of that one. That would be cool. At level two, they tend to get like maybe two like of the deluxe size samples and then two like sachets of skincare. So the Dr. Dennis Gross Alpha Beta Glow Pen. Oh, self tanner for face. That would have been hilarious. Still all out. This works morning eyes. Yeah. Yeah. A more specific skin result. Yeah. Living Proof Perfect Hair Day 5-in-1 Styling Treatment. That sounds strange. Cause wild rose flaming. Right. The only thing I'm a bit jealous of is the drunk elephant la la retro whipped cream because that sounds cool. All right, let's see if we can go check out what level one they're getting. All right, so they're looking at getting the Clinique, and so they usually just get the samples. I think level one. Oh, I've not been level one in a long time. Uh, the Clinique moisture surge. Eh, Josie, Josie Marin Argan Oil. I've got that before. I keep not using it. Dermalogica C Serum. Eh, Juice Beauty Stem Cellular. Anti wrinkle. Mm. Josie Morgan, Josie Moran, whipped argan face oil. Yeah. All the Toka perfume that could be pretty nice. I tend to like the ones they include. Detox face mask from Mainland and Goods. Mm, maybe. Ooh, if they got the Stella all day waterproof eyeliner, that's pretty good. Like in a mini. All right, that would have been sick. Toka perfume. That's a nice smelling one. I've never owned it, but I smell it. Ooh, they got Floral Street. I love, oh my god, and if they got a mini Chantacelle lip chick, lipstick, are you kidding me? Chantacelle is like on my, like, love list. Like, I just love, like, their packaging. Over here, I can just show you. So, alright, level one, I don't know, I'm curious, like, how they got that lipstick. I need to go find out. I'm gonna have to look. But Chantacelle, I'm pretty sure, is not the brand I was thinking of. I thought they were the ones, no, it is them. See, look at this weird lipstick thing, like, like the cheek color. It's like coral in it. How cool is that? I know. I just love like their big pans of makeup. Like that's like, it's like one of my dream brands that I would just love to own. Uh, like mostly just the decorative palettes. They look very pretty. It just seems like they have a lot of other products. I thought they only had those palettes because that's all I cared about. Hmm. All right. So yeah. So this. This is what I got. This is what other people are getting. I'm intrigued to see how we all go. Um, and I'm keen to play all these. Usually, definitely like at least one of the products from this ends up being something I use regularly. For my last one, I'm still going through my Laura Mercier translucent powder. What was the lipstick in that one? I don't even remember. Yeah. Like, whatevs. Um, so, I don't know. I just, I wish instead of the paper they like, did the biodegradable things and cute little box. 
right, that is the Beauty Loop box. I hope you enjoyed. I hope if you like were vibing with me or enjoyed seeing what I got, you decide to stick around and maybe subscribe. Like that would just be the bomb, diggity bomb. But it's cool if you don't. You just want to see what I got because I understand. Anyway, I love you so much. Thank you for stopping by. You're amazing. Mwah.